Hey guys, so I have a fun Lush haul for you today, and if you don't know, it's Christmas time at Lush, yay! Are you excited? I'm excited. Uh, so yeah, I have a huge haul, like, as evidenced by the heavy bag. The heavy Christmas Lush bag. So, yeah, um, actually this morning was kind of, kind of bad. Um, college stuff. Um, so yeah, I was not feeling pretty good, uh, but then I went to Lush, and they helped me out, so I'm all good now. Well, not really, but Lush helps, so yeah, I got a bunch of Christmas stuff. So if you've never been to Lush at Christmas time, like I haven't, like I hadn't, but now I have, they have a bunch of cool, crazy, fun Christmas stuff, so I highly recommend you go check it out, because you won't regret it. So yeah, I'm actually going to have to keep the bag right here, because... Yeah, there's a lot of stuff, and uh, I'm going to, sorry if I rush through this, but there's a lot of stuff. So, yeah, let's just get right into it. All right, so first we have, oh, uh, this one's cute. Look, his name is Satsumo Santa. Is he not the cutest? See, he's a little Santa, and he has a little, little sack on the back, holding presents for the children. And, yeah. He's like a reddish pink. I can't, I'm really bad with his scent. I think it's like orange blossom. But yeah, apparently he turns, well actually I've seen videos, I know he turns the water like a reddish, like a bright red. And he's huge. He's a bath bomb. So I'm probably actually just going to use him once, which is kind of crazy. But you know, that's what bath bombs are meant for. So you get the crazy fun effect. So yeah, that's Satsumo Santa. It's Christmas time. Go pick one up. Well, not Christmas, it's holidays. Whatever. So next we have... Ooh! This is Christmas Eve Bubble Bar, which is actually my first uh, Lush Bubble Bars that I bought today. So I'll let you know how that go. So it's like blue with a little moon on it. And as you can see, it's kind of sparkly and glittery. Yeah. And it smells like lavender, I think this is. Yeah, so the, the, the name Christmas Eve is meant for that you're supposed to use this on Christmas Eve because lavender is like calming, right? So you calm down and go to sleep for Santa so you're not up all night like bouncing off the walls. So yeah, I might actually use this on Christmas Eve. Who knows? That's fun. Ooh, so the next bubble bar that I got is called Candy Cane. And it looks like a little candy cane. And it's pink and white, and it smells really sweet like candy. If you've tried Rockstar Soap from Lush or Creamy Candy Bubble Bar, this smells just like it. Just like it. I swear, this is like Rockstar in Bubble Bar form. It's really sweet and good. I recommend it. So next we have... Oh, okay. This is a bath bomb, and it's called Lil Lush Pud. Like Lil. I love the word Lil. And it looks like this. It's like brown with like white on the top of the little holly leaf. How cute. And this smells... It's sweet. I think it's based off of like Christmas pudding. Which I usually don't have. I don't even know if I've ever had it. But it smells good. It's kind of spicy. But sweet. This, it's, it's sound, it smells like a Christmas scent. Yeah. I'm sure it'll be good. I'll give that a shot. Next we have... Oh, I like this one. I've actually bought this one before. Ah, it's called So White. And it is just pure white. Like, it's really boring looking. It's just white. But it smells like apples. And it's like a clean scent, too. So it's like a really fresh, crisp apple scent. Oh, I love this one. Creates like not a ton of foam, but it creates like a thin layer of like a white foam on the top. It's really nice. It's relaxing. Really nice scent. So next we have. Oh. Her name is Bearded Lady. And it's. I think this is like supposed to be Mrs. Claus. It's like a little bearded lady. She has chocolate chips for eyes. And yeah, it's a little beard. And it smells a tad herbally, but I didn't really buy it for the scent. 
I hear it's supposed to be moisturizing, which anything that's moisturizing is awesome for me because I have really dry skin. So, yeah. That's Bearded Lady. Hey. Hey. Okay. Yeah, sure. Alright, so next we have, um, sorry about that, that's my brother's friend. We have a soap, I actually have got three of them. And the first one is called Snow Globe. And it looks like this. And honestly, in the store, this is like a big sphere, like half, semi, half of a sphere. And there's like these white chunks. I'm sorry, I did not get a good piece. But there's like white balls, like immersed throughout it so it actually looks like a snow globe really cool sadly the piece i did i got did not have much of it that's just like a tiny bit but yeah it's like a really clear blue and this smells like lemongrass it smells really fresh and clean so i'm sure that'll be really fun kind of like a wake you up kind of scent so next we i guess i'll continue with the soap tangent this one is called Snow Cake. Sorry, I haven't opened all of these. Snow Cake. And it's, this one smells like... I think it's described as marzipan, which if you've ever had, it's like almonds. Oh, delicious. It's like the most delicious treat ever. And it looks like this. It's white, and it has... I don't know. It had, like, a pretty design on it, but I don't know. I think it's, like, a star. But, yeah, it smells really sweet and delicious. Really almondy. Oh, it smells like marzipan. I love marzipan, and I think this one is really creamy, too. So, that's that. And could you please stay out? Yeah, thanks. All right. <laughs> Sorry. And the next soap we have is Mandarin's Tea Party. All these are Christmas soaps, by the way, so they're only available during the holidays. So if you want them, go get some now. And, yeah. Okay. This is Mandarin's Tea Party. And it is orange. Ooh. Bright orange, right? Yeah. So this smells like orange, but it also smells a little bit spicy. I can't really do I think it is really mandarin oranges. And if, as you can see, there's actually like dried oranges in there. I think that's cool. Some people are grossed out. But yeah, it's really, it's really unique. It's like orange, but it's not like a sweet orange. It's kind of like a more tart orange. It's weird. It's good. Go check it out. And the last couple things I got are two shower gels, which these are my first Lush shower gels. So I got Glog and, drum roll please, Snow Fairy. I'll start with Snow Fairy. So if you haven't heard, Snow Fairy is apparently like Lush's crazy Christmas. People stock up, people buy like liters of this. Like, I don't know, some people collect this like crazy and they never use it all, whatever. And so yeah, it's like pink and on the bottom it's cool. It has like blue iridescent glitter. And this smells, if you have bubblegum lip scrub, it's that scent exactly. It's like really sweet like candy. There's like a, something else in there. It's not like pure sweetness. I don't know, it's some, there's something else. It's really unique though. But yeah, it, it does smell really good, but I wouldn't buy like bottles of this. But yeah, it's Snow Fairy. And I've actually tried out a sample of this before and it works really well. So yeah, if you haven't gotten some, Go try it, but just don't go crazy. You know, there's enough. And the second one is called Glog. And this smells, oh my gosh. It's like, I don't know how to describe it. It says, um, after one too many glasses of mulled wine, uh, wash your hair and body with our warming, spicy, cinnamon-filled shower gel. It's like cinnamon, but it smells like every spice in the world in a shower gel like really spicy but it smells warm like it's really weird like you smell it and you can tell it's just going to be really like warming and just really comforting which you know during the winter when it gets crazy cold this sounds perfect 
So yeah, really spicy, 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 warm and delicious. So 